Hey guys, what's going on? It's Ross here, and today I've got for you a new series on FIFA 13. Yeah, so basically before I start, I just want to say I didn't actually make this idea up myself. I got it from Zerka, and basically I saw him get a lot better as a player since he started doing this. So I thought, well, why not try it myself and try and get better as as a player while getting out some videos for you guys. So yeah, if you haven't seen Zerka's packed out series, basically the idea of this is all the money that I make from games, as in FIFA games and coins and everything, I can only spend on packs, so I can't bid on players in the in the store, in the trade-in, literally I can only use my money to spend packs, but the one thing I will say, the one rule I will set is that I might have to at some point give myself contracts from another account, because obviously it might get to that point where I don't have enough money for packs and all my players have run out of contracts, then it's game over, you know, so... It's, it won't be as fun for you guys, and there will be a goal to this. I'm trying to. I'm. I'm not sure what I want to do yet, but like when I'll stop this series, really, as long as it gets good feedback, I'll continue going. But in terms of like my goal is to either have like a certain full, say for example, Brazilian team, or example to win the online league one. You know, something like that. I've got to set myself a goal, and if you guys, any of you guys, have sort of an idea of what you guys you know want me to get so say you know if there's a team you want to try and see me get just from packs you know it'll be you know it'll have to all go down to luck but you know I might do it you know I might be able to do it so if any of you guys actually do have any suggestions please leave them in the comments below and also I do and I will continue to do my life stories or, you know, things that people want me to talk about. I got some good comments in my last video, so thank you to those that commented. I'll actually feature a comment in my next video about that. I'm not sure what gameplay I'm going to do over yet. It may just be a FIFA one, but it might not be. Oh, and in this pack here, i got Elliot Bennion, who's a South End United player. For those of you that don't know, South End United is my local team. And they're not very good during League 2, but, you know, you've always got to support your local, so... Of course, Elliot Benyon was always going to be in my starting eleven. So yeah. Anyway, guys. Yeah, like I said, I will be carrying on that my life thing and just other stories that people want me to talk about. You know, someone someone's asked for one that I'm going to do next next video, and his comment will be displayed on that video. So you know, just you can see who wrote it and whatnot. So that's cool. But yeah. So getting on with this gameplay anyway. Obviously I've got a full bronze team and like I say I can't I can't even go and buy I can't buy formation cards or anything like that. I have to get them in packs. So I've got to hope I get some pack luck and maybe get someone amazing in a gold pack who will sell for loads and get me loads of coins to buy some more packs, you know, hopefully. And this guy actually has a pretty much bronze back and then gold forward really. So I knew that if I could keep it in his half I was doing alright. But at the same time, if he he could quite easily counterattack me, and he did do that a few times this game, guys. So yeah, I knew that my defence would have to be good this game. But also, if you want to see this live comms as well, it obviously will be harder for me to do. But I would definitely give it a go. But you guys will have to let me know whether you want me to live comm while I'm playing this or not, so you can actually get my live reactions and all that. So that's yeah, that's another thing. But yeah, so I'm hoping that. I might save up straight away and just go straight for a gold pack rather than spend my first amount of money on bronze packs. But yeah, got off to a good start against this guy. He, to be honest, didn't have much chance with this one. Come off the post, I got a lucky rebound. But in all honesty, I think I deserved this. Bear in mind he had better players, but obviously, unfortunately, straight after this goal, he goes up the other end a couple of minutes later and pretty much just dicks on me and quite an easy goal for him I was quite frustrated to concede straight away after scoring it's never something I like to do but you know you can't really do anything about it guys so yeah and then in he goes again not long after and goes 2-1 up which again I was annoyed about because it was more of a counter attack but it wasn't too much of a problem got on the edge of the box and this guy here Dow he is a beast, you'll see later on why, but he's, for a bronze card, he is a tank, and, you know, anyone building a bronze team, you know, get him in your team, I'm telling you, but here he comes again, slides it past the keeper, very nice, 
And again, guys, you know, I'm hoping that I can quickly get bronze pack and start to, to get some new players. But obviously, as you can see at half-time, well, it was 3 to up. I think thoroughly deserved. If you check the half-time stats, he does actually have a little bit more possession. But having said that, I also have a lot more shots than him. So I think I've done a lot more with my possession. His possession was more in his own half. And then he just hit the ball up and tried to counter me. So obviously starting the second half, I knew that really I needed a two goal cushion. Manages to fall through here, and it's that Mandel again, quite far on the edge outside of the box. Obviously I saw his keeper coming out, so I hit it. And then again here, players tussling for the ball, Dow is back on it, edge of the box. Similar sort of run to what he done in the first half, and slotted it home. So by this point, you know, it's 5-2 up, and Cruz in, and then another ball comes through, and sloppy defection. Defle deflection, but luckily my man Elliot Benyon from Southend was there to slot it at home. So I'm glad that he got a debut goal in there. And then unfortunately it started to go a bit sloppy toward the end. I mean he got, you know, just some crappy breakthroughs, poor defence and sweated it past me. You know, I had chances to sweat it against him in this game, which is actually a chance right here, but I didn't because you know I did I I don't like sweaty goals, you know. I only do it if I'm super desperate, I wasn't in this game, so, you know, I don't really blame him for sweating his ultimate team, so everyone's going to sweat, aren't they? So, yeah, and then he gets another ball over here, and somehow just, I, it was too easy, you know, one thing I hope I get him some goal packs coming up is some better defence. My strike, because I'm actually, I'm not too fussed about my strikers at the minute, and as you can see, in fact, look, Elliot Benyon was somehow man of the match over Dow, I'm not quite sure how, when Dow got a hat-trick. But there you go guys, there's my first coins on the ball, this, the game does finish 6-4 uh, to me, as you can see the stats there, I pretty much dominated him, somehow he had a bit more possession, but again it was all in his half really, why he was just tackling me and trying to clear it, but obviously the shots have completely dominated him, deserved the win, even though he had a better team, so now hopefully we can push on from here, maybe go up another league, but I don't want to go up too much before we've got the players, I only want to go up, sorry about my phone, right at the end, but yeah, so... Anyway guys, that's that. Hopefully we can get some more points on the board and get some more coins and some more packs. If you like this, please give it a like rating and give it a comment. You know, good or bad, just let me know what you guys want, okay? Thank you very much guys, I've been Ross and I'm out. Peace.